Aloha everyone! I'm Gabby and I'm Georgie and we are the mummies of Sisterhood Furniture and content creators for Dixie Bell Paint. In this tutorial we will be working on this suitcase that will follow us in our trips all over the world. If you follow us on Instagram you know that traveling has a special place in our hearts so we thought to paint the suitcase as colorful as our travels. We just wanted a very colorful suitcase but actually we had no plan. Another go with the flow project. So let's get into it! Let's do it! First I cleaned the suitcase really well with white lightening Dixie Bell Furniture Cleaner. Because this is plastic I applied two coats of adhesion primer from Dixie Bell Slick Stick and I let it dry for 24 hours prior to painting. For the base coat I mixed some yellow with a bit of green and I mixed and mixed, added more yellow until I got a zesty electric shade. Once the first coat was dry, I started to layer some mint julep. I picked up a bit of paint and applied it in many directions as well. We are not going for a full coverage, so picking up smaller amounts of paint will allow me to leave some of our base coat um, color picking through. We applied a lovely apricot, we thought it will look amazing between green and the next color which is hot pink. It will just make a really, really nice transition. This lovely color is actually a custom shade of peony and flamingo. I just don't know the quantities, I just mixed the colors until I liked it. Especially as I don't need big amount of paint, so I didn't measure them. Our next color is tea rose and then I mix some lucky lavender underneath it. I blended in just a tiny bit of orange near the pinks and that's it. The next step is creating lots of sprinkles with pure ocean, the gulf, pine cone and a bit of yellow. So I picked up a bit of paint on the brush, water it and it's so cute. On the side of the piece I took a um, pencil and I started to draw some eyes looking in many directions. And then I colored them first with white, then blue and in the end I contoured them with a black permanent marker. And I did some lashes as well. On the other side of the piece I still draw some eye but um, now I did a um, stencil of an eyebrow so I just thought it will work really well with red eyebrows but then I switched to black. In the end we decided that on the back of the piece we will just draw a um, big eye paint nice eyebrows, some piercings and we are almost done! We first sealed the suitcase everywhere with easy peasy wax and then waited about 20 minutes to set. Afterwards I applied some black wax to make it look a bit old, dirty, because we will make it very dirty anyway when dragging it in our adventures. So the travel dirt will only bring more character, original dirt, with a story. I let the wok set for 20 minutes and then I buffed off the excess with a piece of cloth. 
We left the work set for about a week and then we sealed the suitcase with three layers of gator hide. And this is the final result! Thank you so so much for watching, hope you enjoyed this tutorial or it inspired you in any way and if you did so please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more painting tutorials! See you next time, bye!